Uh, we're Ray and Candace. From Need More Designs in Portland, Oregon. We like good design and great stories. We also love coffee and discovering new and amazing coffee roasters. Did you know that over 2 billion cups of coffee are consumed in the world every day? And there are thousands of small and large roasters out there roasting phenomenal coffee. Join us as we discover new coffee one bag, one episode at a time. This is Unpacking Coffee. Okay, today on oh. Unpacking Coffee, we are unpacking Cat and Cloud uh, of... They're around Santa Cruz. That's not their actual city, though, is it? So this is an interesting company. It's, it's actually apparently run by the Beastie Boys. Super nice people. Oh, do you have that? On the invoice, they wrote uh, a very nice thing. Did they call you a brother from another mother? That's right. Something yeah. like that. Some sort of brother. Yeah. They only sell two coffees. And they, they seem to sort of schedule them out ahead of time, so... They kind of have a date on the website, which I thought was cool. Like, yeah. it's like this is this this is your choices, A or B, and they're they're fresh. And then when they're gone, you know, is there something else here? No. Let's just start over. Let's just introduce ourselves okay. and say they're from Hello, yeah. California. Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. Just relax. Okay. okay. Hi, I'm Candice. I'm Ray. Welcome to Unpacking Coffee this week. Cat and Cloud. Cat and Cloud. Yeah. Of San Luis Obispo. Their packaging caught my eye on Instagram. It's super playful, fun. They have a lot of attitude. I like it. They have a, good, a lot of good attitude. Like the cut of their jib. Yeah. Mm -hmm. they, they only sell two coffees because that's how many you should sell. I think that this is sort of a side project. Yeah, I think so. And too. so I don't think that they have a cafe that I can. But these guys are both uh, Spoiler alert. barista champions. Is that fair to say? They've competed, yeah. They've competed, I don't know if they're champions yeah. or not. They're champions in my I'm not going to vouch for them. Yeah. Uh, their coffee is amazing. I think their packaging is really great. Yeah, it's kind of punk yeah. rock. Like, it's just like, it looks like they just kind of wrote, here, here it is. Just wrote it on there. They have a great uh, blog post on building brands online. And they're fantastic oh, at that's it. Great. Like I found them online. I found their podcast. Everything I've discovered about them has been via social media, we have a sense of who they are and what their brand is. And what I loved about what they talked about was instead of spending hours perfecting photos with succulent plants behind them and red brick walls, <laughs> what they were basically saying is just be authentic, take photos, and then spend that extra time focusing on your craft and getting really good at it and getting that out also. You found out about them through social media, right? Yeah, and yeah. I think that's one of the first things that I noticed about them is they seemed to be real. Mm -hmm. and they seemed to be having a good time, making something they really love, and just putting it out there. I think they do all that incredibly well. They met at the USBC in 2007. Six. I have here in my notes seven. I think they've been hanging out since 2006. It says here that they met <laughs> in 2000. The United States Barista Championship is an annual competition to decide the most well-rounded barista in the United States. Competitors prepare and serve three courses of espresso-based beverages consisting of espressos, traditional cappuccinos, and signature drinks. The winner represents the United States in the World Barista Championship. Okay, so their podcast, uh, I listened to a few episodes over the weekend. Yes. And uh, they interviewed the folks that just did the uh, Barista, the new uh, documentary. About. Oh. That was kind of an interesting insight. Anyways, their, um, their podcast is, uh, they keep up the energy. It's like 45 minutes a week. Yeah. And they actually, they actually put it out every week. Yeah, and uh, they seem super interested hard. and energetic. I yeah. know. They're... Got a lot of energy. They they also seem to skateboard, and one of them works full time at another coffee roaster. They must be like 22. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or something. That kind of energy. Yeah. Okay then. So Cat and Cloud. Mm -hmm. Are we done? Should we get footage of both of us to sleep? 